hello if you are new to my channel my name is Shania but you can call me Naya and if you're a returning subscriber so as you can see from the title, yes, it's time for a new chapter or it is becoming a new chapter. I'm also going to be fixing myself up. Actually, I'm not even going to say fixing. I'm just going to be doing my makeup. You know, it ain't nothing really to fix. You feel me? <laughs> but if you've been here since day one, A1, I'm just kidding. I don't even know where that came from. If you've been here for a minute, you grew up with me, I get a lot of comments, especially on TikTok, when people find my page. It's like, oh my God, I used to watch you. I used to watch you in elementary school. Now I'm in high school. I used to watch you in high school. Now I'm graduated and all of that. It really blows me away. If you've been here, if you grew up with me, this is definitely a video you should stay tuned in. Just to give you guys an update on my channel, what's been going on, why I was gone, what content I want to create. Also, I'm sorry if I'm everywhere with this video. It's kind of been a lot going on mentally and just behind the scenes. I'm sorry if I go <laughs> different places. I'm gonna try my I'm gonna try my best to just flow. Okay, I'm gonna try my best. I'm gonna try. Look, I barely could talk. I'm gonna try my best. <sighs> okay. Let's talk about it. How have I been doing? Honestly, I want y'all to know I am good. Right now, I'm in a good place. Like, I've been doing way better. Feeling way better within myself. So, I want y'all to know, like, I'm not stressed out. I, I seen some comment on my last video saying I look so stressed out. I mean, I have my moments. Don't get me wrong. Adult life has its moments. But, you know, I'm learning and I'm growing and I am way better. And just taking it day by day. The way I was feeling, I was very anxious. I was very just, okay like I gotta do better I gotta do more this and that I gotta keep going and it's just like I don't want to live like that you know it's just not the hustle and grind I feel like it can be a toxic way to go about things like don't get me wrong yes make your money get your bag but do it in a way that works for you it can burn you out and that's what happened to me also let's just jump right into it skits I've been dealing with this for a long time I just was not feeling skits and it's just like it carried on with me and it's just like I don't want to keep going like that if it's not working for me right now why keep trying to entertain it but it's also hard when a lot of your supporters came from watching my skits i'm not saying i don't ever want to do skits ever again like i'm over and done with it it's just to the point where like it's not working with me right now a lot of those skits that i do like are four three five years ago i'm definitely a different person like i'm not even the same person i was a few seconds before this video started you know <laughs> i'm just kidding it's been a real battle with myself especially when i've grown from that i've grown from my skits so yeah, i'm not gonna lie it is scary it is kind of like are they still gonna support me is this it i don't think like that i don't but i'm not gonna sit here and lie like those thoughts don't come up but i also remember that i enjoy this i still want to create content i still want to talk to you guys also it was a tweet um she makes skits too but i'll put the tweet up he said i'm not going to lie this skit shit is not for me anymore hasn't been for a while i'm on bigger projects y'all i felt that in my soul it feels good to know i'm not the only one and i know many people go through that too but y'all i would stress myself out and that is exactly why i had to take a break being a content creator it's just the algorithm and i know you can't blame the algorithm i don't if you're thinking about starting making videos you know you have to be consistent that's the only way you're gonna grow you get to a point point where you feel like a robot it all takes planning and strategizing of course but sometimes it does get overwhelming when you have a job you have your vacation you have your breaks and being a content creator it just does not give you youtube does not give you that space to take a break and it's okay you'll still have your followers or your subscribers here of course you will but it messes up your whole algorithm you start seeing drops and everything like i don't even like going to look at my analytics sometimes it tells you a lot of stuff it could be helpful it can affect your just how you feel about creating i'm not complaining of course it helps but at the same time it just doesn't give you that space to just breathe like a lot of your favorite people have taken breaks i also got some new concealer the juvia's place so i'm gonna try her out oh yeah this is good 
I'm gonna keep going. You know, if you guys are with me, you're with me. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I have no exact niche right now, but I know that I want to keep going. I've been on YouTube for so long, so it just doesn't make sense for me to just doubt myself and think that it's over now. I'm not gonna lie, I have felt like that. I don't wanna say felt, I've had thoughts like that. Thoughts come and go, so. You know, and the ego likes to play real tricks on you. And this concealer is my color. That's crazy. But I want y'all to know I love creating. I love reading comments. I'm that more appreciative of it more. I'm also learning to just be more gentle with myself and just let things, you know, come to me. But just do my part because, you know, you can't beat yourself up about stuff. I just want to do whatever feels right in the moment. It makes no sense to make skits if it doesn't feel right with me. You guys would see it right through the camera i see why people do their eyeballs first before they just hop in i think i'm gonna come back let me come back to y'all i'm also using my girl fenty yes we love her the powder foundation i forget what powder you gotta actually do your liquid first so do that i'm really shocked i got my color everything is just an experience it's a learning experience i'm going to keep going you know like that's just what it comes down to that's all i can really do be more engaged just talk to you guys okay so content i do like lifestyle videos but then i i like just random stuff i like like my boyfriend picks my clothes or my brother picks my clothes or random things if that makes sense i don't even know what that makes any type of sense like what random things and i i like get ready with me morning routines and you know working out videos but yeah just skits this is not the move right now y'all i do want to start doing films but i'm not quite ready for that i wanted to do like no my light died I just want to be more intentional with my content. It gets so old when you're just doing it for the wrong reason. So I don't know if you rock with me, you rock with me. And I appreciate that no matter what analytics is telling me. But my ultimate thing is that I just want to be in a good place creating content that I enjoy, that I will also watch. Because I'm going to be honest with y'all, I kind of cringe at some of them videos. Don't get me wrong. I don't hate it. I'm not bashing myself because that was a time and it brought me a lot. I'm not sitting here knocking that but i'm not gonna lie like i just don't want to put on no damn wig my blonde wig or you know i just don't want to do that i might have a moment that i'm like oh this will be a good skit like i should do this but if you are a creator and you you know taking a break it's okay at the end of the day like people still go through situations you know i lost two family members and things happen and sometimes it doesn't give you that space but that's also when creating rap Rapidly and just planning ahead helps for sure. I still use the Sacha, Sacha, Sacha. I've had this for a minute. I probably need to get rid of it. At the end of the day, I'm still human, having a human experience just like you. I'm no different from you. I'm in a good place and I'm enjoying it. I just want to clear that up because <laughs> I don't want people thinking I'm out here depressed because I, I was at a point. You can only depend on yourself. And I know it gets hard and that's okay. It really is okay. Okay. If you have your moment, if you have your day, if you have your month, week, it's okay. Like, it literally is okay. Just be able to know that it, it does get better. Ugh, my shoulder, oh my god. I need to go see a chiropractor. The setting spray, I got the Ultra Matte. Like Nipsey said, I didn't want the fame. I just wanted y'all to feel me. You feel me? I do like mindset and spirituality, but I don't know. I don't know if it will be on. I don't know. Like I said, yo, I don't know. I don't. It's kind of like you got to like me for me at this point. I'm just, I'm ready to keep going. I'm tired of being sad. Like, I'm going to be sad some days. But, you know, I'm just like, I'm over it. I'm ready to move on. I'm ready to be happy. I'm ready to be confident in myself and know that everything is taken care of. I've been feeling like this for a while and that's why it kind of just crashed and burned in my face and i just had to take a break everything happens for a reason the only thing i can do is just do my part and give the rest to god i don't know if i should put on lashes i kind of don't feel like it i feel like once you get individual lashes it's just kind of not the same like oh not my eyes watering oh damn messing it all up 
Ooh. Okay, so um, I lied. I'm not putting on these lashes. Ain't nothing wrong with a little mascara. I'm just ready for the next chapter of my life. Like, you know, I was doing skits. I mean, for a long time. But when I started growing, I was 18. Your girl is 23. So I curled my hair. That is all for this video. I hope you guys feel me. I really do. But I just want to know if you have been supporting me and you know this is the end of our journey. I just want to say thank you. I appreciate it. Things are going to work out as they should. But like I said, thank you so much for your support. I really appreciate it. Like I said, we're starting a new chapter. And if you rock with me, just rock with me. I love y'all so very much. Thank you guys for watching. And I will see you guys next time with a brand new video.